get the shipping document and that's going to be one way that we know the, the quantity of goods as well as when the shipping uh, actually took place and therefore be able to tie that out and consider when revenue was recognized. Then we have the sales invoice used to bill the customer. It uh, contains information on the type of product or service, the quantity, the price, and the terms of the trade. So obviously the sales invoice is our invoice. So we usually call it an invoice from our side. To the customer, it's going to be the bill, right? <laughs> We're sending out the invoice to the customer. They are receiving the bill. Therefore, this is going to be usually the point in time with a lot of accounting software might trigger a sales process recording revenue at the point in time the invoice happens. But note that that really if they're shipping goods, the revenue should be recorded at the point in time that the shipment happens or when some type of delivery happens, whether it be FOB shipping or FOB destination. So we're going to have to be looking at the relationship between these types of items and when the system, the accounting software, is recording the revenue uh, with relation to them.